Hey, what's up you all welcome back to my channel in this video i'll be talking about ticker symbol chek check cap limited the stock is up 100 percent just in today's trading session there's a pretty bullish run for check cap limited i'll talk about specifically what caused this run up i used to own check cap so i'll also tell you what exactly i did with my check stocks and when i sold it so watch the full video we'll also look further into my personal uh, thoughts and opinion about check cap and where where the stock can go from this price point now without further delay let's talk about check cap i'm not a financial advisor so do your own due diligence and research check cap is a penny stock you can double your money exactly like what you see like in one day on the flip side you can lose them all so do not invest your entire portfolio or savings into just one stock or just into penny stocks make do your due diligence and diversify your portfolio consider subscribing to my channel because we have been talking a lot of penny stocks a lot of small cap hyper growth stocks that have turned out to be a pretty good investment in 2021 consider liking this video as well your like is very much appreciated it ensures that my efforts my analysis and research can reach to more and more people so consider subscribing liking my channel and click on the turn on turning on the notification bell as well now let's take a look what exactly happened so the stock had opened up pretty high because in pre-market the stock was up and it opened up pretty much above the four dollar level it went to as high as four dollars and uh, 25 cents in today's trading session as you can see right here this is a very small company and let's talk about what exactly happened to the stock they got an fda approval for ide uh, phase that their product is in in uh, that, that their product uh, is in at the moment for c scan now the company announced that the first and only patient friend patient uh, preparation free screening test to detect polyps before they may transform into colorectal cancer or CRC they announced that US Food and Drug Administration also known as FDA has approved company's investigational uh, device exemption application so it is permitted permitting checking the check cap to begin pivotal study in C scan within the United States and C scan is intended to uh, for the candidates who are at the average risk of CRC and who are uh, not financially stable candidates for a colonoscopy or if they do not want to do for whatever reason and if they have declined colonoscopy now this is not a replacement for colonoscopy but this is a low cost uh, quick turnaround time detection for polyps if they are developing within a human body now what this means for this company is they have opened up the door for the next stage to get full FDA approval now let's talk about uh, what exactly the stock is and I covered this stock uh, before and I sold check check CHEK the position that I had after I believe 70 or 80 percent uh, gain when I got it and I took that money and put it into Zamedica Corp so this is the this is what I exactly did with my uh, money that I earned from uh, check and I put the whole capital into Zom and I am right now at uh, three times more money that I invested in in, in Zom. Now, looking at check cap, going back to check, uh, what this company does is uh, it's a C scan system that can detect uh, precancerous polyps in precursor for the colorectal cancer. 25% of the asymptomatic average risk screening population presents uh, the polyps into the colon. Uh, that can potentially turn into the cancer over time it can take up to 10 years before a polyps develops into an invasive cancer and this detection can be accomplished using this particular uh, system or innovative technology that check has developed now what this exactly is i can tell you in uh, within 30 seconds so there are three different parts of uh, this application the first one is a C scan cap, which is an ingestible capsule. So someone can swallow the capsule and it am, it is an emission of ultra low dose of X-ray beams. It's not a concern. It is a, it is a very low amount of radiation and the company has confirmed that and the study has confirmed that as well. Scanning this, uh, this it also scans the GI tracts and it is an autonomous and natural passage through the an autonomous and natural passage through the GI tracts and the total X-ray pressure dose is similar to of a single chest radiography so which is not really a problem so this is the first uh, thing that capsule that the patient can swallow the second thing is this three patches that the patient can worn on their back while they are doing this test or detection and it is an integrated positioning control and recording system 
through which the technician and or the physician can examine the results and it is a continuous recording of a storage of a c scan caps information and the third and the last part is c scan view as you can see on my screen which is a cloud based uh, analysis suite that allows physician to analyze data anywhere so it does not need it for you to for a patient to be in the hospital where the physician is in they can just do it through the clinic or any other platforms that they are available at any given time and it's a construction of 2d and 3d maps of the inner surface of the colon that allows the physician to analyze further and detect the polyps that can potentially turn into the pre uh, cancerous position uh, uh, situation and it's a precancerous precursor analysis and detection uh, system that this company has developed this is pre this is the pre-analysis and bookmarking of the suspicious finding by an expert technician and if the results uh, seem serious they can move on to the next the patient can move on to the next stage so this is a very low weight uh, very uh, very cost effective uh, way to detect it's not a replacement of colonoscopy i just wanted to say that i found based on my research and why this is pretty pretty important for the company because this is their path their strategic path at the moment they already got the regulatory approval for the marketing in eu and israel the next step that they have is u.s pivotal study and this study that they're planning to conduct in 2021 given that now they have this fda ide approval for the pivotal study for the c-scan they have they will be moving pretty quickly given that the situation with the pandemic that is going on there was a little bit of delay here or there but the company finally got this approval now looking at the company the company has enough cash to run their operation and they confirmed in q3 their net income was negative 3.62 million so they're not burning huge amount of cash they do burn cash because it's a cash heavy business they do not have revenue as you can see in q2 no revenue 2.89 million negative net income in q1 uh, no revenue negative 3 point 30 43 million dollars and uh, we're waiting to see what they declare in terms of q4 we're not expecting revenue we're expecting negative cash income already uh, but uh, and, and on the top of that the company already mentioned that they have enough cash on hand to run and sustain their operations now looking into today's volume the volume spiked up pretty big time as you can see their volume was 412 million and the previous day volume was 1.8 million million now looking at this if the volume sustains now once again there was a hype and as you can see the stock already came back from its highest level of four dollars that it's four dollars and 24 cents that it started so there is a sort of like from that point the stock went down 25 percent but the stock gained 100 percent as well so if anyone has bought the stock prior to this date they're already making uh, a pretty good decent invest uh, investment return as you can see that their uh, one year range is four dollars and 49 cents that does seem like a lot of people bought the stock and might have sold it above four dollar level which is why it called and, and it is once again it's a healthy profit booking that might have caused and triggered the stock to go back to three dollars level now this given that they have ID approval I do believe that the company has a bright future that they can get an approval for this product and this is once again an innovative product a newer way an innovative way to pre uh, uh, detect a cancerous situation in a human body so this is going to be a revolutionary product if everything gets approved and the company is on on target to make this happen so the volume is pretty huge let's consider the average volume that's pretty low 19 million compared to 42 million so we are looking at 20 times more volume uh, obviously the stock spiked up as we all noticed after hours the stock is a little bit lower two dollars and 91 cents which is also okay in my opinion because it's healthy profit booking if someone bought at the hype might have to wait for the next uh, big spike that might happen very soon given that they have a great great momentum from FDA looking at it by the way the RSI looks pretty healthy in my opinion the one day RSI after huge volume is 40 which is a very healthy RSI MACD looks pretty good as well if you can see the blue line is above the orange so blue above the orange just uh, once again for one day trend it could run a positive tomorrow given that this high volume I do believe the RSI sustained throughout the day even though the stock was above four dollar level the RSI spiked up at four dollar right here it went to as high as 100 so the sell-off was very much expected because of the over 
bought condition. So the stock became overbought in the opening, which caused this dramatic downturn. Uh, and it tried going back up once again, but the RSI suggests that it was pretty sustained RSI at that point. And it, the price range was $3.58. The stock did come, up, uh, come down, but once again, it went up. So what I'm trying to say is the technical indicators does not really suggest that the stock will spike up tomorrow or day after to $4.50. But there is a strong momentum in the company. There is a strong uh, way forward for the company. I just wanted to share my update because I invested in check in the past we have been reviewing this on this channel as well i gained 60 70 percent i don't remember but 60 to 70 percent return and i took the money out put it into zom not that i did not trust the check but i found better opportunity i thought it's a better opportunity to invest in in zom and i could gain more return on the investment that i can make so that's the reason why i invested in zom and uh, i just wanted to share an update as to what happened to check Thanks all for watching. Consider uh, subscribing to my channel. Click on the like button. I'll see you in the next video.